Scotland is being battered for a second night by high winds and freezing conditions. Now, in a moment, we'll be hearing from our reporters at the Fourth Road Bridge and on Deeside. But first, the remarkable tale of a climber who was caught in last night's atrocious weather. He'd suffered a leg injury while climbing in the Cairngorms, but managed to drag himself almost a mile before sheltering in a first aid equipment box on Loch Nagar overnight. Stephen Duff takes up the story. These pictures, taken only days ago, show the challenges facing climbers in Loch Nagar. Experienced climber Bill Church took on the challenge. It almost cost him his life. After a checkup at Aberdeen Royal Infirmary, thankfully no broken bones, just a bruised but painful ankle. The 61-year-old retired eye surgeon had gone on a solo climb in Loch Nagar yesterday. His wife Jane feared the worst when he failed to return home. He sort of somersaulted down to the bottom of the gully and um, uh, that was it really. He'd injured himself obviously and started cr crawling along. In fact, Bill Church crawled, hobbled, dragged himself for four hours till he got to a first aid supplies box like this at the bottom of the gully. Not designed to take a human, Mr Church nevertheless struggled inside and stayed there until mountain rescuers arrived. A couple of years ago, I think, and they sort of joked about, you know, there's room to get somebody in here if you, if you needed to be, you know, but I didn't think he probably would have needed it himself, you know, but um, it was good to know he was there, I think, and um, probably saved his life, really. Around 60 mountain rescuers took part in the search for Mr Church. He said, oh, I didn't think I'd expect to see you tonight. I thought you'd be first thing in the morning. Thank you very much for coming. <laughs> From his bedside, Bill Church offered a huge thanks to those who rescued him. Stephen Duff reporting Scotland, Aberdeen.